The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the World Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship. This is going to be good. It's a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. He can't get crushed by the Hulkster. Yeah, many have tried, but very few. Make way for the double champ. Only a small handful of WWE superstars have held two championships simultaneously, and this man now joins their ranks. Yeah, it's an honor no matter how long you hold both titles, but the reality is most double champions lose at least one title before long. This man is determined to be the exception rather than the rule. The double champ showing off all of his hardware. Arrogance and confidence on the double champ's face, but he's obviously earned it. Introducing the challenger from parts unknown, weighing in at 377 pounds, Mean Dog Scott. And his opponent from Venice Beach, California, weighing in at 303 pounds, he is the World Wrestling World Heavyweight Champion, the You win this title, you are primed for big things. Big title match here, in my opinion, this championship could main event any show, any place, any time. What a declaration, Byron, but given the competitor's vibe for the title tonight, I'd be inclined to agree. Carefully placed, stop to the arm. Both wrists captured. And Pythons is famous in sports entertainment lore. What does an adversary have to do to level the playing field against the Hulkster? Well, the best way to kill a snake is to cut off the head. Focus attacks on one of Hogan's cannon-like arms to render it immobile. No pythons, no power, brother. Oh, two. And he finds an answer for the Hulkster. Series of reversals. He's heading back to the ring. Oh, the 
Looks like Hogan's getting the Hulkamaniacs involved now. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. Got to find a way back into the ring now. Before the count runs out. Backbreaker. Oh, challenger's a little worse for wear now. With the counter. Close fist connects. Tossed into the corner. High risk area up there. What more can this superstar do? Reaching deep into the arsenal. This could end the entire match from the top floor. Superplex! That move wasn't originally intended for the top rope, but that's what we just saw. Oh, he foiled that attempt. Stop the holster here. Here we go. Start the count. Any more punches and sacks is going to have to take his shoes off the count. And misses on the springboard. Backbreaker. Elbow drop. A couple of them connecting. And then a little, and a little disrespect for dessert. Measured knee drop. The challenger being outclassed here. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Back in the ring now. Dropping the elbow. And he's just flaunting his skills now. Just an onrush of offense here. Yeah. And the pitch. Do you hear that, Corey? Oh, I can hear it and I can feel it. The sound of Hulkamania, baby. Leg breaker. Carefully measured knee drop. A move made synonymous with Paul Hogan. I think the champ's got it. Looking for the victory. Two. That's it. The champ stays the champ. Here is your winner. And still, world wrestling and world heavyweight. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets.